What is going on you guys? Local John 1812 back with yet another food review. We're at Krispy Kreme. <laughs> they got some new donuts we're gonna check out. Uh, just wanna give you guys a little side note. It's near and dear to my heart. I've been crying last few days, upset. And uh, I'm not gonna make a big video about it or nothing like that, because I'm just gonna stick to my routine and do things that's gonna help me get over it faster. Uh, which I'll probably never get over it. My dad's not doing that great. Just wanted to tell you guys that. Keep my family in the thoughts and prayers, please. Other than that, let's get to the food review. That's fine. Um, I will take a. Hot maybe? Yeah, it's probably that. Yeah, I'll take eight. The honey puller parts, they're out of them. But we'll come back and get them next time, guys. Guys, we have a tremendous amount of stuff from Krispy Kreme. This Krispy Kreme and the milk. <laughs> this Krispy Kreme in here. Here in Evansville, Indiana, on the east side of Evansville. Great job, great crew. They made me feel even much better. Um, walking in to do a food review for the first time in a while. You know, been about five, six days, so. All right, guys. I'm gonna put on the Krispy Kreme hat. Gotta have that on. Good? Yeah. Okay. You didn't mess up your duck bill. <laughs> um, and I'm going to show you this. This is the uh, postcard thing they would give you it gives you plant me and this is about planting wildflowers for honeybees so that way they can come a wreck around to maybe where you live and all that and if you're allergic to bees maybe put it further away from your house or something but this helps bees pollinate and create honey and help us and they help uh, spread the seeds and stuff like that so plant that go get it at Krispy Kreme if you buy a dozen which I didn't, but they were nice enough to help me out and hook me up because they knew I was doing a review, review, and it was free publicity for them. So they were like, "Hey, go ahead and take that," because they didn't even. And he said, "We don't sell much of the a dozen of the honey ones, anyways." Okay, so here is the which one's this one, camera mom? The honey bee. Okay, one. let me read it first. So it's the um, oh honey donuts. Hold on, are you trying to do No, no, I'm, I was just, zoomed I just, in. I'm just doing stuff. Okay, so the, then the Honey Bee Donut, that one there, an original glazed donut dipped in yellow icing, decorated with black buttercream, with, then finished with two mini cookie wings. Yes. Which, there's nothing extra special other than it looks like a little bumblebee. Yep, or and? Honey Bee, sorry. Yes. Then there's the Honey Cake Donut, that one, that looks, one there. That looks awesome. It does look awesome. A glazed sour cream cake donut drizzled with honey icing and finished with an oat crisp topping. So that is the regular honey bee first. All right, we're gonna try to get- The vanilla wafers. Look, I done got <laughs> icing all over. Okay, here we go. We're gonna try to get some cookie and everything one bite and one, here we go. Oh wow. Oh, also, Krispy Kreme will also plant flower gardens at select shops to create more bee-friendly environments. Oh my gosh. That icing reminds me of a cake. Mm-hmm. Like it's a, just buttercream icing. Right. But you know, sometimes you get buttercream icing on a donut, and it doesn't taste just like it would like when you eat a cake. yellow icing cake. Your this, mouth is all black. <laughs> this tastes... Like you're eating cake. I mean, it's delicious. Okay. I would give that one a solid A because it tasted just like the icing with the honey taste to it, but it tasted just like honey cake icing. I mean, it, it literally did. But there's no honey in that one. It tastes like it had it. Are you sure? Mm hmm. I, I would give it's it a. It's just one of these. I would give it an A because that icing was spot on. I love the design of it. And their donuts are always good like usual. Reach in there and grab a napkin wipe your mouth. Don't do that. All right, we're going to move on to the next one. Glazed sour cream cake donut with the honey drizzle and oats. Here we go, guys. Wow. Those oats really bring this alive. You get a wild taste in that oats. Like, mmm. Nice sour cream cake donut. But what it is, is you get a little bit of taste of that honey, right? And then the oats. It makes you just feel like you're just 
Eating something from nature. <laughs> Eating something from nature. This too would get an A. Krispy Kreme, you have outdone yourself. I guarantee you that pull apart would have gotten an A. Yes, all these honey flavors and the designs are spot on and I love what you're doing for the environment. So, no matter if you don't like bees or you're allergic to them, we need them. So if you don't mind, camera mom, <laughs> if you don't mind, go to Krispy Kreme, buy a dozen of the honey bee donuts and get yourself one of those plant me postcards and plant, not the whole postcard, you take the little bee thing off and you plant that, okay? Wow, guys, we're gonna continue to upload and things are gonna happen with my family and all that and I understand get we will be posting though because this helps me get away from things, guys. It helps me think about something different. I don't want to be just curled up and and not do anything. Sometimes I feel like doing that, but I want to be with people and, and, and just... My dad, that's what my dad would want me to do. He would hate it if I was just sitting around, you know, really upset. So, I'm going to drink some milk, and that's all we have, guys. We will be back. We'll, we'll, we'll try to do some... Um, some type of family fun vlog this weekend. It's gonna be hard, but we'll try. So, that's all we have, guys. Don't forget to like, subscribe, comment, and share. Until next time, guys, happy bee eating. Be safe, everyone.